Hello Taurus, welcome to your reading. Uh, we're going to take a look at your person's feelings for you. We'll get into some other things here. Thank you so much for being here, you guys. Uh, please like and subscribe. Welcome if you're new. Please only take what resonates, what makes sense and fits for you. Whatever doesn't resonate, please just leave it on out. It may be a message for someone else. And Taurus, let's get started. Here we go. right here okay Taurus a lot of you are taking a break here from someone uh, someone here who came with questionable intentions I feel like this person was really uh, <laughs> there's a very lustful energy here this person also had some some negative things really tied to them attached to them uh it, it like affects their behaviors this person might have been lying uh being really deceptive here i feel like this is someone really new this is something that really kind of just started it's still kind of fresh here i feel like you're taking a break here i feel like this uh person is giving you a lot to think about when it comes to growth when it comes to what you want uh when it comes to uh things that you expect uh in a connection when it comes to someone working with you uh putting that nurturing care into you, into the connection. There may be something that you found out about this person, some type of information here. All right, I feel like there's a lot of uh, looking at social media as well when it comes to you and this person, but definitely bad news, definitely something coming up, something that you're finding out, some type of information here. It's like what's attached to this person, what comes with this person, dealing with this person. And this may be certain things that you're finding out here. I want to get a little bit more. Show me more. Again, yeah. Can't escape this card. This person's behaviors were very suspicious. This person was really good and really smart, really clever at hiding certain things here. Yeah, they've definitely been exposed. There's disappointment. You've walked away. Focus on growth and new beginnings here. Beautiful way to start with the Queen of Pentacles here and the Ace of Pentacles on top of that. So again, new beginnings, new doorways here for you when it comes to love. Uh, focusing on real commitment here. I feel like you're taking a lot of time to self-reflect here about everything that's happened and just ready to start over. Ready for something new. So we have Capricorn here. We have Scorpio. We also have Virgo. Okay, I want to get into this, uh, this person's feelings, Taurus. Let's see. There's one. <laughs> okay. Uh, very up and down. One moment they're calm, one moment they're loving, one moment they're passionate, and the next is totally opposite. Very up and down, very back and forth, out of control, lack of balance, lack of control. Okay, this person doesn't know what's going on here. It's almost like they're confused. There's a little bit of fear here, fear of what's happening, fear of this balance, fear of the juggle very impulsive person i feel like this person wants to take some type of action here this person may be thinking about calling you reaching out telling you they still have feelings for you i feel like this person also uh really likes control this person almost looks like they feel entitled to have whatever it is they want like oh taurus isn't gonna leave me taurus isn't going nowhere taurus is staying right put but i feel like this person is going to be surprised here taurus very quick, impulsive, unexpected energy here. This person wants to fix things. They want to talk to you. They want to do something brash here. It's 
like they feel like this is their moment. The, this person may tell you that they want to change. They want things to progress forward here. But still, it's like secrets, things unknown here. Very quiet, not giving certain answers, not talking about what needs to be talked about here. So again, there's still secrecy. There's still something being kept, but yet wanting to come forward and wanting to offer something, wanting to talk about feelings, wanting to remain in control. This person can be very tricky, but I feel like they're very confused right now and they don't know they don't know where you two are going. Yeah, this person's feelings are also all over the place here. Very up and down. This person can be really moody when it comes to their emotions, Taurus. It's like you never know what you're going to expect with this person. But they don't know what's going on here. They don't know if this person is going to be able to mend it, to fix it. This is what they're thinking about here. And I feel like this person is going to be really clever, really tricky, really careful when it comes to this relationship, when it comes to this connection. Yeah, there's that coming forward here with wanting to work things out, wanting to provide what's needed, wanting to build, wanting to mend things here. Yeah, I feel like this person, they don't really feel like it's over. I feel like this person thinks that the two of you still have a chance. This is what they're feeling. I've, I definitely see a conversation here about wanting to work on things, take it slow, take time, and uh, offer what's needed here. Whatever it is you've been asking for, or whatever was exposed here that brought this ending, this disappointment, this news, right? This unexpected information, Taurus. I feel like this person's going to try to pull all the tricks out the bag here. I want to get a little more here. Yeah, they want to give what's needed. So, yeah, this person definitely wants to come through and offer something here. They're not done. Uh, this person is, again, it's like they just have this, I know that we'll be together right now. Okay, we might not be speaking right now. Okay, I've been busted. Okay, things have come out. But hey, I still love you. I still have feelings for you. It's that kind of energy here. So... Let's see. Let's look at some positive things here. More positive things. Okay. We have balance here. Healing. Moving forward. Okay. So, some positive things to look forward to here, Taurus, for you. is more balance and happiness when it comes to uh, moving forward. I see a lot of confidence. I see a lot of excitement and also stability here. Stability here with what's coming next to you, towards you. A lot of attention. A lot of fun. Meeting new people. Living in the moment. Uh, really doing things that you want to do. Again, it's like you're building completely over, starting completely over and really focus here on the things that are important, uh, people and connections that are solid and that are coming correct. So it's a really beautiful way to move forward with confidence and stability. I see a lot here of you being happy and having what it is that you want, what's uh, going to be provided for here. Beautiful energy, soulmate energy here. A lot of reflection, sweet memories, sweet thoughts. Truth, clarity, strength, also communication here. There's a lot of thinking back, reflecting on memories. Definitely a conversation coming through here. New adventure as well for a lot of you. This new adventure is going to be one that has more peace. It definitely moves forward, uh, more strong, more grounded more exciting. It's more balanced, not so up and down and chaotic and unsure and tricky. I just, I just feel like you guys are going to be so much more at peace within when it comes to moving forward. Okay, let's see. So we do have Pisces here. We have Taurus here. We have Sagittarius, Cancer. Leo, Taurus, Aries, 
Okay. Ooh. Oh. All right. Be mindful of someone who is just uh, really just. <laughs> Be mindful of someone who just comes with a lot of passion and a lot of lust, and that's all it is. Uh, relationships starting with just that, right? Really hot and heavy, but there's nothing else there. Nothing else to keep it going, all right? Someone who will promise to build. Someone who can't keep promises. They don't keep up with their actions, their words. It doesn't match, Taurus, all right? A lot of endings here. Yeah, someone who's really showing you who they are here, someone who's hurt you before, uh, someone that you've ended things with here. There's been a lot of broken promises, a lot of lack of action here, things not to being given, but being promised, being talked about. This is what I feel to be mindful of, that sneaky energy here that just creates more stress, all right? It creates too much. Walking away here, leaving the hard times here. For that light at the end of the tunnel. I feel a much more supportive relationship here when it comes to new beginnings. More peace, more balance, more truth, more strength, and again, excitement, right? That's what I'm getting here. But yeah, I just feel like there's someone here who's just all about that, right? All about sex, all about in that kind of moment, having that kind of intimacy, but no other intimacy, no emotional intimacy. You know what I'm saying? Like there's just so much here, especially in your area of walking away and starting over new and such strength and having fun and having the confidence and balance within Taurus. That's beautiful. So yeah, a lot here, but let's get more. Let's see. So we have Scorpio again. All right, for Taurus. Okay. Passion. Allow your heart and soul to sing with joy. So still enjoying passion, still having that intense chemistry and connection. But someone who can reciprocate, right? And having more than just that. It intensifies that feeling. So really beautiful. Heart-to-heart -heart conversations. Honestly discuss your feelings with each other. So I do feel like there's <clears throat> a serious conversation that's going to take place for a lot of you with someone. Someone wants to express their love to you. They're going to make a romantic gesture. That's that surprise. That's that giving you something. Definitely offering something up here, Taurus. A lot to be expressed. All right, let's get a little bit more. How's this person feeling towards Taurus? This person is also holding on to hope. Ooh, there's one. Okay, I think about the times we were intimate. Again, there's a lot of that lust, a lot of that passion. It's like there was nothing wrong in that area. I love talking to you. I wish I treated you better. Okay. I became obsessed with you. I am working on my mental health. This person is really trying to get things together here. I'm coming back to you. Again, that feeling of this person doesn't feel like it's over. This person is holding on to hope. This person may have become obsessed with having control and feeling like they have that power, feeling like they can do what they want to do. But now it's like that bubble has been popped. You pop their bubble. You burst their bubble. They don't know what to do here. Okay. What else? Three. Perfect. Let's see. All right. Taurus, songs are reminding them of you. This person did lie to you. This person is thinking about this. So funny. It's like this person is in a really dark place right now and really trying to come out of it. Really trying to get into that light, that opening there. My life is upside down. 
that bubble, it's, it's, it's gone. It's been bursted. They don't know what to do here. They miss talking to you. They want to talk to you. They want to express their feelings here. They want to do something romantic. Again, they're just trying to do whatever it is. What can I do here? But they want to have a heart to heart. See? Taurus. Wedding. Marriage forever. The one union. Date. Courting. Dating. Meeting up. Getting back out there. Spiritual awakening, enlightenment, epiphany, and life lessons being learned. Uh, for some of you, this is a rebirth. This is a complete and total new start here for you. I, I just have that feeling of like from the ground up, just completely refreshed, like a whole brand new you, a whole brand new everything. That's what it feels like here. Okay. Definitely learned a lot from this situation, this person. Taurus. Holding back. Someone here is holding back their feelings. Someone here is holding back. They have a wall up. They're protecting themselves. They don't want to deal with this. Time to go now. Ready to leave. Walking away. Time is up. Needing to breathe. Needing space. Needing time. Yeah, it's like you're detaching yourself from this person and what came with them, what was attached with them and focusing on you. Allowing your heart and soul to sing with joy. That beautiful balance within and confidence and fun and passion. New adventure here. All right. Needing space, feeling trapped or controlled. Not going to be all in. Taking a break is ending it. In the clouds, floating on air, happy to be in love and bringing it down to earth, coming back to earth. Some of you are really in love here. This person is really falling for you. This person wants to surprise you. Again, there is this energy here of wanting to express how they feel. Projecting stories in their head, makes their own rules, puts their stuff on you. This person may create a lot of stress, a lot of tension. This person can be very controlling. Uh, they like to project. They like to deflect. They don't like to deal with things. But again, it's like all that is changing. Brand new Taurus. Not dealing with the same O anymore. So let's see. Okay, this is yours. All right, Taurus, you've got that one thing that lovers can't quite put their finger on. An intangible, alluring energy that makes them irresistibly attracted to your essence. You have that it factor that they've been searching for. One of a kind, feeling like they're in the clouds. All they can think about is you, being with you, spending time with you. For some of you, it's like they're just wishing they treated you better. They can't help but be attracted to you. They want more. They don't want to lose this. There's just something about you that is so different to this person. Okay. Let's get a little more. More for Taurus. There's one. Better off. Taurus, you are better off. There's happiness here. Having a new perspective here. Clearing your headspace, right? Seeing clear. Seeing reality. Truth. Strength. In that clarity. In that realization. In that enlightenment. Better off. This is the time for you to be happy. This is the time for you. 
to be happy and embrace in your journey in love. Clear head space. Let's get more. Okay, there's an apology here. A return, forgiveness, and gifts. A lot of you are going to be surprised here. All right, this person may show up with flowers. This person may try to buy you something that you like. Again, there is a, a gesture here. All right, something that it may, it's like it's going to be given. There's a lot here, again, to express as well. This person's going to apologize. They wish they treated you better. This is what they're feeling. This is what they're thinking about. A second chance, making amends. A lot of wanting openings here. Having a second chance, making amends, opportunity, plans. Again, a window open. Having that opening here, that opening of happiness, that opening of light, that's you. And that's what this person is trying to get to. That's what this person is hoping they can come back to. Some of them might have a rude awakening here. All right, let's do one more. We have limit. Okay, so there's been a ripple effect here. Final straw, overload. A lot of you feel like you've reached your breaking point and you are now ready to walk away. Again, a time to sing with joy, to be happy. A breath of fresh air for you. Taurus, that's what I got for you. That's what I see here. Thank you so much, you guys, for watching. Please subscribe. Don't forget to hit that notification bell. And I will see you guys in the next video. Happy holidays, you guys. Take care. Bye.